<clears throat> uh, excuse me, I'm out of cough drops. This is for Leo, Taurus, the Empress. I don't know. Where do you want your messages at? Make up your mind. Taurus or Leo. So, um, I guess Leo is at your moon. We are reflecting on it's what moon energy is. And that doesn't, I mean, yes, this, this is emotional stuff. I'm not here to put you in your place. I'm here to correct you. I'm overqualified for all my positions. If you think I'm saying things that I don't know what I'm talking about, but I do know what I'm talking about. <clears throat> all my degrees are listed on my Facebook page. Um, and that's not even all my degrees. That's why I don't work out in the field because people in your generation get offended because I'm overqualified and you, your generation thinks that I was stealing your jobs or whatever. Well, we were all just raised differently. Your generation was raised to stay at one job and master it and think that you're going to climb up the ladder. And then our generation... My generation, Generation X, was raised to uh, get a degree, study as much, and skip jobs every five to seven years and climb up the ladder that way. <clears throat> and then there was a huge cuts everywhere around, when was that, 2008? And everybody was forced to go back to school for your generation. Because that was happening. My generation was getting out of school. Um, I am qualified for the, the mental health. I was, I'm a licensed administrator for the state of Pennsylvania. I have over a hundred documented hours for administration. I also did almost 10 years of working in a mental health personal care home where I took care of hundreds of patients, hundreds of staff members. I have over hundreds of documented training hours through Western Psychiatric qualified documented hours through uh, the Department of Welfare and also hundreds of hours of documented through Mercy Behavioral Health that were all approved through uh, <clears throat> the Department of Welfare. So just a little FYI for you. You're here to, on a 5D le level, to communicate with the 3D level, not to diagnose them, to tell them what their problems are. And that is it. Not to direct them, not to tell them where to go, not to give them advice, nothing. You are here just to confront them. That is what you are doing. Confronting people of you as a human, as a person, on a surface level, when you see this problem, you are confronting them of it. That is it. The word that you are looking for when someone hides what they are, um, like their past and stuff like that, it's called regression. You are required to read Sigmund Freud's Interpretation of Dreams. It's a very heavy book. It's about 500 pages in small print in a small book. It's about that thick. Somebody studying psychology. I also have a lot of psychology background with my degree. I have a human resource major, a double major in HR and IT. Okay. Human resource management and technology. This book on a college level, it's for pleasure reading. You're supposed to read it during the summer. It'll probably take you about a year to read it and to interpret it. The word that you were looking for is regression. People do hide their past and all this stuff is surfacing up and you are here to confront them of these problems. That is that. There's no reason for me to have a LinkedIn page. I had a LinkedIn page for a very long time. I'm not looking for work or hiring people. There's no reason for me to have a LinkedIn page. All my schooling's on my Facebook page. I have a resume. I don't need to prove myself. I've already proved myself my whole life. I never took a day off, never took a vacation, nothing ever. Work my ass off. <sighs> I don't waste my money. 
I'm looking pretty in my house to impress myself. So. Mm, I'm not accepting these are truths, and that's the problem with uh, your generation, my generation. Please decide uh, where you want your messages in Taurus or Leo. Everything works out for you. So I don't know what, what your complaint is. It's not a valid complaint. I can't hear it. At your age and where you're living, you are working on your retirement. That is where you're going to be retiring. That is like everybody's dream. So I don't know what you're complaining about. I mean, you could sit there with your door open year round. That is really nice. I mean, I live in Pittsburgh. You're from up north. You uprooted yourself and you moved down there. That is a decision that you made. Now you have to live with that. You have to reground your roots. Forget about where you're from. You left that. The answers that you need are interpretation of dreams by Sigmund Freud. Yeah, you're dealing with these emotions too. What you're confronting people about. Rebalancing yourself. What are you giving to other people? I don't know. Is this the same problem with the other Leo I was... Uh, reading about all her donations and everything. She got everything at the beginning all at once. Things cycle in five years, five to seven years. Your generation had a hard time seeing this. The generation after me, Generation Y, has the same problem, the millennials, but the Medela effect happened. So now Generation X is considered the Medela. So, or the millennials, because the Medela effect happened. We already went through the shift. You moved, you uprooted your shift. So now you don't get to see what happened at your, where you're from. And you're not accepting this. You're not accepting these truths. You need to deal with these feelings. When you're reading, you know, look at yourself. I don't think I need to explain this to you. Anything else, please? Anything else? Yeah, you're reinvesting, regrounding yourself. Yeah, you need to finish healing for this new passionate beginning to come in for yourself. This is you on the table here. There's nobody else. You need to finish healing yourself. Why did you go down there? I haven't even made it to North Carolina yet. I'm trying to do one big trip. And um, the person that I'm communicating with is like, no, those are all separate trips. But I don't know. I'm not even arguing about it. I can't see. I'm a single lady. That, <clears throat> excuse me. That's you. This is the light being shine on this that you're looking for. Don't get used books either. Get a new one. Yeah, this is ego. Anything else? It's not, this is not bad. You have to deal with this. That's part of, you know, you have to accept that. You have to fight your ego. Everybody has to go through it. You need to meditate on this. You need to ground yourself, reground yourself. You're regrounding yourself. Yes, Empress, see? Gathering more information about where you left. Now you're defending this hard truths coming in. Taking action on yourself. You're juggling. You know, you already did what you did. So now you got to make it work. You hated it up there. I don't know, think about past. People are bugging you, like I said, because of where you live. Start looking at, uh, you know, like I said, restaurants that you want to go to. Um, so when these people come down, 
they need to be staying at hotels and you need to meet them. If they're coming down for a weekend, just encourage weekends and you can meet them for a drink or whatever. All right, I'm done. I'm not getting into this anymore. Please decide where you want your messages. I'll talk to you later. Bye.